Okay, we're going to look at um, our root 6 minor pentatonic in its basic form, and then we're going to expand it. Look at the expanded form and the expanded form with triplets. So let's take the key of A, just because it's a nice general area of the guitar, and that way up here where the fingers are cramped or way down here where there's a little bit more space. But let's just start in the key of A, which is on the fifth fret. Let's refresh and play the basic version of this. Now, fingering is so important, all right? Using first and fourth. Then here we use our first and third. Back to first and fourth. First, fourth, first, third, first, third, first, third, first, fourth, first, fourth. Finger per fret is generally the rule. Now that's when we're practicing. When we play, depending on where we're going, where we're coming from, uh, fingerings, you know, will change. But we want to have a basic framework for how we practice things. So if we go to fall down, we know how we're going to break our fall. Okay, so if I'm going to, this pinky up here, that note's also here. And so I'm going to expand this and I'm going to add this box down here. These two notes are not new notes because they're up here. That's its octave. So I have not added any new notes, I've just added an, another octave another variation of where that note can be played, okay? By expanding this, bringing this note down here, now I'm able to use my first and third fingers. And I get a lot more speed out of that than I get out of... Nothing wrong with this, but if you're looking for speed and to, care, and to cover some territory, this is a nice option. And watch how I'm moving up with my third finger. And I'm moving down with my first finger. I'm using first and third fingers only. Now, these two notes here are up here. So we're going to expand this upward as well. Now you want to be careful when you switch strings to your second string there's just one fret difference. Now, I've always applied the 10,000 times theory. You need to play that 10,000 times. Then your motor skills really know how to play the scale. You don't have to think about it. You can begin to think what you're going to do with the scale, what lick you're going to play, how you're going to put these notes together. If you're trying to functionally just get these two hands working together, it's not going to be musical. So. I always tell students, you know, play it 10,000 times. You know, if you've done 40 times today and 60 times tomorrow and skip the next day and did four times the day after, you know, add it up and you're on your way, but you still have ways to go. So I'm going to play the uh, expanded version a couple of times for you just to make sure that you see it. First and third fingers only. Moving up with your third finger. Moving down with your first finger. Then we're going to do triplets. One, two, three. 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 And then three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two. I'm 
Oops, sorry. Three, two, one. 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 Now you want to smooth it out. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. that 10,000 times. Literally. Then you can go up and back uh, going up 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. Come back. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. Okay? Play that 10,000 times. So here's four variations. You've got your basic to play back and forth. Literally, I'm serious, 10,000 times. Expanded to play back and forth 10,000 times. Expanded with triplets, up one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, back, three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one, 10,000 times. And then up, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, back, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, 10,000 times. It may seem extreme. But until you do that, are you really going to have the command over what it is that you're trying to do? So when people don't do that and they come in and say, well, just show me how to play lead. Well, I can show them, but they have trouble doing it because they don't have the skills to bring to the table to, to master the technique. Okay, So just do this and everything will start taking care of itself, I promise. All right.